What are the best tips for attending startup conferences? So this is this is actually really good. Um, startup conferences, I think, when you're first looking for people, is a huge, huge benefit. Um, you know, finding a co-founder, talking about your idea, getting comfortable selling. You know, talking about yourself, talking about what you're working on. Those are things you need to do to get to, to get noticed. So my recommendation is first and foremost is, is is meet people, of course, right? You know, wear you know wear your name tag, wear your company shirt. Um, you know, you know, be outgoing. Uh, some for some people that's hard. Actually, for me that was quite tough in the beginning, and I sort of forced myself to talk to people um, and do it. Everyone's there. They all have sort of most people that are at these conferences are passionate about it. Uh, so the conversations are really easy. And um, so, so in terms of the, the people in attendance, definitely make an effort to talk to them and tell them what you're doing. Don't don't be don't hide your idea. Um, you know, at, you know, be outgoing and and and, and ex, you know expect people to give you good feedback. And, and some people are going to give you bad feedback too. But just keep talking about it, and that will get the word out, which will always be helpful. The second, a couple other things that I think are really important about conferences are are have a go to a conference with a plan. Uh, what I mean by that is you should know the speakers if there's if there's a speaker list and you should maybe even know the attendees if there's an attendee list and you want to really study that list and see who would be valuable for you. If you're raising money then maybe it's important to talk to uh, you know entrepreneurs who have raised money before or the actual investors themselves and just shaking their hand talking to them saying yeah you know we're not raising money right now but you know we're thinking about it in the next six months I'd love to grab you a coffee and just tell you and see if you thought this, think this is something interesting. You know, do those things. People, I mean, that's where the people go to the conferences to make those connections. So, you know, go out of your way to, to, to seek out, you know, a handful of people um, and really, you know, make, you know, make an effort and, 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 get, and get those connections done. The last thing that I would say about conferences, which, which I always try to do, and it's not always easy, is there's sometimes a lot, there, there's usually a lot of value in the speakers. So if you can find a way to hang, you know, I would say like hang out with the speakers somehow, um, especially if they're hanging around a conference for a couple days, that is the way to go. You know, don't be like creepy. I mean, you certainly want to be nice and make sure you like study them in terms of like know what they do, know their company. Like, go in and ask them a question that actually makes them think in a good way, right? Don't ask them like why are they different from someone else. Ask them like what do they think about, you know, mobile changing? Then you know, I don't know something something like that. Something that actually put put a little thought in it, and you can engage those speakers and you can spend time with them. They will not only they will not only give you really good insight and information, but hopefully you can you can form a connection with them and and also the and a lot of other speakers will hang out together, so you'll be able to connect with many of the speakers, which will be very valuable. And for many reasons, uh, those are typically the, the reasons why you go to a conference. So that that would be awesome if you can connect with a lot of those people and face to face.